Well, hello everyone. I have right here, this right here is a picture right here of a you know, painting right here, look like with me right here. And it, like it sure seems that way is toward it. When we do uh, speak about mail a lot of times, it sure seems that way that, uh, you know, yeah, that uh, you think about mail a lot of times. And the, the, what's the first thing that you're going to be thinking about whenever you do think about mail a lot of times? It's like, yeah, an envelope right here and all that from where that contains um, a number of letters and um, messages you know, for what's in the mailbox, right? But uh, it sure seems that way that, uh, that uh, do we necessarily think about that, maybe like a pretty please or something like that, or if you're trying to take care of something, and maybe if it's at the last minute or something like that, but uh, yeah, yeah, for charities or something like that. But, uh, but I include this uh, image right here, you know, some of the Photoshop work right here, of me right here, and let's just say that... Um, if this right here was supposed to be an example right here of a picture, I'm like, yeah, a picture or something like that. And uh, and people might say is to where this right here is supposed to give you an idea of uh, the purpose for for the mail right here. You know, the purpose right here, like you know, for thank you very much right here, and you have right here with that with the hands folded like that right there. You know, with the the you know, hugs and, and arms folded like that, and uh, like if I was wrapped around with the blanket right there. So whenever you do check your mail a lot of times, that um, you know you're probably thinking this toward okay yeah there you go. you check your mail a lot of times, and you think it is toward it yeah, you think about an envelope a lot of times, and uh, so you whenever you read the the messages over here that uh, thinking is toward okay yeah that that you hello right here but uh, so yeah so whenever you do look at that right there and thinking this toward it um. That yeah, you know, uh, it starts out with uh, you look at a picture, just like an image, you know, just like you know, kind of like that right there, and then you would see messages coming up right there, and so that's why it seems like uh, everybody might say that, uh, you know, uh, yeah, that uh, any advertisements that you might see and all that, but uh, still, but if I were to include um, something like this, and uh, let's just say that. Uh, that like right here, that uh, if I were to mention about that, uh, you know, talking about you, know, please watch or something like that, and uh, so if I were to include right here of talking about that, uh, you know, yeah, please watch right here. <laughs> So yeah, if, if you were to see that right there in the 102, that uh, any messages that uh, that you would get, you know, kind of like that right there, and uh, at the time you're always 102 that you know you start conversations with anybody really, and at 10 that um, that yeah, you know, you go ahead and show somebody how to do that, and uh, you're warned to where that you know really how does it really all start whenever you do think about that, you know, whenever it all starts. Does it all start by uh, that, you know, whenever you uh, you want to go ahead and pre-order to get your tickets today or something like that? Yeah, tickets to the to the, event, to the ball game or, you know, maybe to the show or something like that. And, um, you know, everybody uh, might even say, too, that uh, that um, whenever you do think about that, it's like, uh, you know, yeah, hello right there. And then you would see these messages right there. And uh, but still, that the top up for please watch right here. And. Uh, so yeah, do you have a minute right here? And I would like to discuss more options right here. But uh, so yeah, so if you were to actually look at this right here, and um, this thinking is to where that uh, that you had this uh, this with this uh, with this kind of this example right here. But uh, but let's just say this right here was supposed to be uh, an example right here of like anybody were to get the idea about is this to where that yeah this right here is supposed to be like a little animation right here to where it's like a little bot or something like that you're talking to you and uh the, the similar stuff that you would may, maybe see on the television set right everybody might say that uh that you know whenever you do start a conversation a lot of times that uh that you know yeah you go ahead and show somebody uh, how to do something and a lot of times it's like 
you know, you're of a thickness to it exactly, you know, who taught you how to do that and all that, but still, that, uh, that, you know, you go ahead and, uh, like, you know, with these, cover I'm like, oh, yeah, dead and not recorded, but it's like, you know, happy holidays, and then, um, there will be something, you know, that, uh, would show, like, you know, yeah, P.S. right here. Yeah, P.S. and, uh, you know, you know, I hear that there will be like a little initial right there. You're saying something such as, you know, P.S. right here. And, uh, 102 is to where that, uh, yeah, that, uh, you know, P.S., um, you would probably uh, say something like that, that maybe if you were trying to pass a, a message for somebody uh, saying this to where that, uh, please, uh, share uh, your uh, experience uh, yeah please uh, share your experience with uh, on uh, the the survey yeah it's a uh, providing feedback and uh, so it's very much as to where that whenever you do think about that by the way it's like uh, you know, everybody might say that uh, that every time you do think about that in your warrant to her, that uh, what exactly is it that that question is asking necessarily? Are that is this is it pretty much asking you know, to her that uh, this right here should only take you a minute of your time? But let's just say if you take five minutes to go ahead and answer a question, few questions right here, and anything else that you would like to leave on the blank spots right here, and then right here. So it's like, yeah, it's kind of like a back and forth, back and forth, you know, conversation, right? Maybe you would maybe want to know, too, that why is it that maybe the mail envelopes, you know, can't really do the same thing. And like anybody say, that, well, maybe, you know, they can, but, um, you know, sometimes it takes a couple of days for them to be able to do it. But we're talking about messages right here. The envelopes that you we get right here within about maybe a matter of seconds that they're going through that. To that, the, to that, be it, I'm like, yeah, going electronically, uh, being sent, uh, on, being recorded on this ticket here, and that's why that, uh, that, uh, yeah, that is why it seems like that, uh, the more faster it is, and maybe that, that the more, that, that more room, you know, you'll be able to fit a lot more discussions in here, and more likely that, uh, what are the chances that somebody else is going to want to go ahead and use it and say a few words. I'm like, yeah, to make them feel a little bit more comfortable with the conversation, right? So that's why it seems like uh, if you were to include an image like this right here, and, um, you know, any designer that might even say that, uh, that yeah, you go ahead and include a big uh, image right here, like uh, something uh, such as an ID, driver's license, or any so anything that shows like a document, you know, anything that looks familiar to you, you know, right? And uh, you're always 102. Anything that really looks familiar to you that uh, that uh, you would, uh, I'm like, yeah, this right here, you're know, a painting. Are you familiar with this painting? And uh, maybe this uh, person is is talking. And uh, so, yeah, you get, you have these meetings a lot of times. But uh, the first thing that you might uh, think about is that uh, this all depends right here. And um, do you necessarily think about that as to where that um, whenever you do answer that a lot of times, that uh, you can you go ahead and put uh, that, you know, could you go ahead and maybe paraphrasing it for that right there. So if I were to write that right there and maybe place that right there on the top right there, and you're 102, that... Uh, that, you know, really, is that really uh, going to make it any more confusing than what it really is? In case of anybody's wondering, oh, too, that, um, that, you know, every time you do think about that and say is to where that, yeah, yeah, this, uh, this uh, all depends right here. So if I were to place this right here, and uh, I don't really know if you want to call it action verbs or causes or paraphrasing or anything like that, but if you were to write like that right there, this, uh, that all depends. This, uh, are all depends or something like that. So whenever you do uh, respond like that, and it sure seems that way that, uh, that you say something like that, and then if somebody were to say, that, oh yeah, I'm familiar with that, 
with that advertisement with that sticker right there or something like that you'll please watch or something like that and so you're thinking this to where okay yeah that uh you start working on something and maybe somebody's going to ask you to uh could you please uh, show me a little bit more of what you're talking about and uh so that's why it seems like that uh you know whenever you first start working on it by the way that uh you you were getting some practice with it but it's like uh Everybody might say that uh, you actually see a lot of common mistakes whenever somebody's in a hurry. You know, whenever they're in a hurry to take care of something, that this is usually what you would see right here. That uh, you would see it to where that, um, you know, somebody's scrambling around, you know, they don't really think about so. So, so yeah, well, really, what can you really do just to be able to prevent, you know, that? And I say, yeah, if you're, if you're in a hurry one morning or so, that, uh, if you're in a hurry, what are the chances that you're just going to let somebody else, you know, take care of it? You know, if you're in a hurry, you know, yeah. You know, if, you, if you're in a hurry, yeah, hurry, I guess, uh, how you want to, I'm like, yeah, you know, for if, uh, the proper spelling, I'm like, yeah, if you're, if you're going to be in a hurry, I think that's, it's hairy or my, but, but still, that, uh, you know, if you're in a hurry, if you're in a rush, yeah, everybody else might say, yeah, if you're in a rush, hurry in a rush, if you're going to be in a rush, for sure, that, uh, you know, you're going, you know, you're not going to be thinking, you know, you're not going to think about things, you're not going to think straight, and so that's why it seems like uh, that, um, you know, it's like, uh, you know, every time you think about that, by the way, that, uh, you know, you start doing things, and not realizing things and uh so that's why it seems like that don't you think that uh that it would uh, be good to go ahead and explain to somebody about you know, this can this all depends but still you take the time to go ahead and look over all the materials and all that that's available right but it's like uh, every time you think about that it's like uh you're always one oh two that uh that you know whenever you do watch something and you know yeah especially whenever you look at a picture right here why is it that this picture, yeah, the way I painted this right here, you know, I'll tell everybody that uh, the way I painted this right here is supposed to be like a little portrait, little design right here, but everybody might say that, you know, you want to go ahead and use this for reference just to be able to show somebody, you know, how to use some of these commands. And uh, everybody might say that you might get that to where that, okay, yeah, I... Uh, I don't mind, you know, do you, hopefully you don't mind me doing that. I'm like, no. It just said it wasn't for that purpose, you know, yeah. So, yeah, that's going to be, like, and everybody might say that, um, yeah, mind. Do you mind if I go ahead and use this? And, uh, you, you don't mind if we uh, park here for a minute or something like that? So, it's like, uh, yeah, if you mind. And, um, Everybody, I'm like, yeah. But uh, the way I think about it too, that uh, you know, if you uh, if you mind, uh, but uh, still, people might even want to know too that uh, whenever you do uh, say, hopefully you don't mind, you know, I'm like, yeah, you know, if it's okay or my, but still. On your hand, that, that that whenever we do think about that in a lot of ways that uh, you have right here is this. Uh, example this image right here and at 102 that uh you know discussions of from what was discussed from earlier right and uh you know did but uh still it's like uh, do you have a minute but um uh, but you see this right here yeah do you have a minute but let's just say if uh the next question is maybe going to be about is this tour if you're going to be in a hurry to go somewhere for sure that um that you know yeah that uh you quick uh, yeah when everybody like to know right quick task teach you what <laughs> and uh like uh, it seems like around this time uh, especially during the holidays for sure that anything that you do very quickly by the way it's like what are the chances that, that that something's going to go wrong if uh, you know if you're trying to work on something and uh, something goes wrong right so that's why it seems like that uh, you know anything that kind of catches your attention for sure but uh, 
your Euro was 102 that, um, no feedback and all that, but, but still, your quick uh, task uh, teach you what? Well, of course, it seems like, uh, you know, uh, yeah, they teach you about, you know, uh, I don't get it. Please explain, you know, yeah. So that's another reason why, you know, yeah. That's another reason why that uh, people might say that, uh, you know, you look at a lot of these messages, by the way. That's way that's way I look at art, at art, by the way, everybody. There are a lot of things that you can see. A lot of things that you can, you can see about your art that you can see and understand about your work that not everybody else can. And then maybe that's one of the reasons why that whenever you didn't have this ability to do all this stuff, whenever you used to watch the TV back in the old days, back in the old days, how often could you provide feedback, right? And uh, so that's why it seems like that uh, after about 15 minutes after you watched your favorite TV show program and and then um, find out that some of the things that they talked about on TV and then and the first or second thing that you think about is, is that, you know, yeah, I don't get it. You know, can you please explain to me uh, what, what... So, yeah, anything, any uh, any shows or documentaries that you do see on TV nowadays, it seems like 15 minutes... That may not explain everything, and so that's why it seems like that, uh, you know, uh, yeah, yeah, this all depends and all that, but, you know, every time you do think about that, that um, you're thinking as to where that, uh, you know, yeah, based on your experience, right? But, um, but you know, really, who really taught you how to do all that? You know, number one, you know, solving puzzles and all that, but, but a lot of what I do see most of the time is that whenever somebody's in a hurry, Whenever you're in a hurry, you start using things and start doing things that you normally don't do every day. And uh, that's what I notice too a lot about what a lot of people are doing is that they do things and use things. Maybe they don't realize that they're using it, but the stuff that you use every day, maybe you don't use it uh, every, every day, but uh, some stuff that um, that you're doing. And uh, you might think is to where that... Uh, you know, especially if you're going to be in a hurry, if you're going to be in a hurry and then uh, you, know, you start doing things and start interacting in a, in a type of way to where that, uh, you know, for what seems to be not so normal and uh, that's whenever that, uh, you know, yeah, you look at the data right here and there was one time not too long ago that this right here was a blank document, you know, you couldn't read it and um and like everybody might say that whenever you're going to be working on something that um, there's a lot of information that uh, that it's not provided. And uh, so like any, you know, any professionals might say that uh, that, you know, if they're if they're going to be looking at a blank page for sure, it don't really tell them anything. So that's why everybody else might say that, uh, you know, whenever you look at these advertisements, by the way, that uh, the first thing that you might see is, uh, you know, yeah. Something kind of like this right here, and uh, you know they're not going to really understand what all that means right there until they uh, you know, see the, all that until they can understand it. But uh, but you know whenever there was just a blank page right there that uh, everybody would say that um, that yeah you know you don't really know what to say until you start reading some of the details right here. And, um, so that's why it seems like that, that is it better to go ahead and watch, you know, what they're doing first before if you feel comfortable enough, you want to go ahead and type something right there. And um, so it's like, a, yeah, you know, you go ahead and uh, do like an infographic or something like that right here. But uh, every time you do think about that in 102, that uh, the first thing that comes to my mind is like, yeah, who, who taught you that? <laughs> There's a lot of things that I learned by myself. You know, I, I learned, you know, at my own time, too. I didn't learn everything from school, so tell everybody that um, that whenever I look at some of my artwork right here, I also keep visualizing as to where that, that this right here was supposed to be like, like a screen say, like it's supposed to speak. You know, like a, people might say, you look at this right here, what exactly does that really remind you of? I'm like, I look at that more like, yeah, like a portrait logo, but it could also be a bias as to where this right here is supposed to be, you know, somebody that you're talking to online, you know, somebody that you're chatting with. And uh, let's just say if that was the case, anybody that you're going to be watching, even on TV, and uh, they're going to tell you that, uh, 
you know, you're going to be talking to them. And, uh, and so that's why it seems like that, uh, you know, the first thing that you tell them that, uh, that this original design right here was supposed to be a portrait before that you, you were using it to show somebody on how some of these other, you know, features and commands were, you know, how they were working. But, uh, it's like, uh, you know, everybody say that by the time it all kind of comes together and it's like, well, it makes a little bit more sense now. But, uh, each time you do think about that and want to know too that, um, that yeah, you didn't really know how to apply, but, um, but anyway, I thought you will go and show everybody here that, that, um, so with this right here, yeah, the conversation right here, but, um, uh, let's just say if I were to add like a conversation, you know, yeah, add a conversation like right down here. I would start the conversation by saying is like, you know, yeah, I think, uh, Yeah, something like that, and so it's like, uh, so you were saying, like, yeah, thanks for getting back to me, and uh, so that's why uh, you're always wanting to know, too, that uh, the same thing that you would maybe get from an envelope, right, but, you know, you're always wanting to know, too, that uh, with this electronic stuff, that uh, electronic mail with the emails and all that, we're talking about, you know, yeah, we're talking about five, uh, yeah, five seconds later. We're talking about five seconds later, and then, uh, you know, you, uh, get about maybe three, uh, yeah, three unread. And then more likely it will probably be flashing in red or something, but yeah, within about five seconds later, you would get something like that right there. And I, I don't even know if that but uh, yeah yeah that looks more like it's right there so yeah yeah you would you would read something kind of like that right there you know so anybody might even say that uh, whenever you first start getting some practice with it for sure that uh you know you're used to putting a stamp on it and having to wait maybe a couple of days before you get a response but now with the uh, electronic mail that uh, you know you might get a response within a minute and they'll tell you you know things that do next and all that but but every time you think about that and you're one oh two that um you know, yeah. You know, did uh, did you actually just get some practice with it and it just start working? Or, you know, how how exactly is it that you were able to get it to work? And uh so it sure seems that way that you know, every time you think about that and people might even say that you know, if you would uh, actually use this as a like a screensaver to where it would uh, help you know, that's kinda like in the background, right? That you would have like a little workspace at about right down here where you'll be able to do your work and then you would have something like this displayed on your screen save or for on your desktop right here or on your phone and they say that you'll please watch and um so yeah that uh you know, so every time you think about that and you will want to know too that uh that yeah some people say is to where wow that that was fast or you know yeah well it's a little bit slower this time but um but whenever you do think about that, by the way, that uh, you do you always have to think about is this to where that there's a, yeah, there's a, somebody that you're talking to that uh, they could be on the air, on the connection there, and that uh, you're talking to them. And uh, and uh, like with me, that uh, whenever you're learning something new, that you, know, you don't really know what to say, you know, too much at a time, uh, you know, at least not at first, and that's why... Uh, it seems like the first thing that you think about is just saying hello and um but it's like yeah so every time you do think about that and uh you know yeah even while you know even while you're sleeping or even maybe even while you're away from the device or something something like that that uh you know you might even want to know too that uh you know if some of that work but uh, still but like everybody say you look at this envelope right here and uh well, I know too that uh, yeah, that would be like an advertisement right there. But um, you show somebody how to uh, to use it, some of this, and uh, sometimes uh, you know I don't know if anybody uh, 
you know, is anybody uh, going to, you know, have, have you ever been asked that question to where that, uh, yeah, that, uh, you know, any examples of what a tick order form or something like that looks like? You know, a form about this size right here that looks like something like this right here. And at 102, that you know, would you actually share this with a uh, with a friend or with uh, somebody else who who asked you, you know, who asked to see the information just because well it's just it was just for practice or anything but people might say that you don't mind if I look at it do you like an, no you know it may not be the result of the problem but um, still you know you know, yeah they look closely at it just because that uh, they don't realize it or if anything that uh, you know, they didn't see it there, there at first, and uh, so that's why it seems like, uh, you know, every time you do think about that, everybody, that, um, you know, anything that you're going to be working on for sure, that um, the first thing that you think about is that, uh, yeah, well, you know, how do you explain about when you actually create something, but then on your hand, that uh, please watch, and uh, you please watch me do this, and uh, so yeah, that you know, it all depends and all that. But uh, you, know, whenever I do think about this, by the way, I keep thinking that you know, is it going to remind you of a lot of things for sure? But really, that uh, what are you really teaching anybody whenever you're doing this? And uh, I guess uh, if it's uh, maybe knowledge, you know, or courage or something, how you want to, you want to call it. But uh, but I just really think in a lot of ways that. Uh, that whenever you do start working on something for sure, not everybody really knows what all that you were working on until that they looked at it real closely. So that's why it seems like that uh, whenever you do think about this in a lot of ways, that uh, people might say is to word it, you know, yeah, you know, uh, that, uh, yeah, yeah, as, as long as it works, but um, it goes by question after question after question. And, uh, you know, tell everybody that, uh, you know, is that really something that really to get used to over the fact that, that whenever you do start a conversation with somebody about something, you know, I don't get it. You know, please explain right here. And uh, so do you think that, that whenever you do start a conversation about something, that uh, you would include like maybe uh, an example of uh, anything that you're talking about? And uh, maybe if it is for maybe for charity or something like that, and uh, everybody might even say that... Uh, that, that this is your ability to where you can actually respond and you can actually interact with anybody who does you know, ask you to sign up or to register or to participate. And um, so that's why it seems like that, uh, you know, whenever you do think about this, that you're thinking this to where, okay, yeah, you, know, you, can, you can see this for sure, but until you share it with somebody else, not everybody else is really going to understand uh, what you're talking about. And so that's why it seems like that... Uh, you know, yeah, you know, you would attach an example right there of something that you were talking about, and then, uh, you know, that's, that's whenever, say that, you know, you'll go ahead and talk about that, but um, still, at the same time, it's like, uh, yeah, I, I got a little bit more space right down here, but uh, at the same time, is that uh, somebody's going to say that, yeah, well, I'm in a hurry, I don't know how. Yeah, I don't know how to do this. I don't understand. So, like, let's just say that if you're going to be looking at that, like that right there, and uh, somebody's maybe going to say is to where that you know, can you please uh, show me? Uh, yeah, show me what you're talking about. And um, if you're going to be in a hurry, you know, trying to get something done, for sure. That uh, what are the chances? That uh, yeah. So that's why it sure seems that way. That uh, you know, do you think that it would make more sense to go ahead and design a logo or a graphic to to show everybody uh, you know how to solve problems and uh, everybody might even say that uh, you know uh, yeah it's not really necessary but you think about a lot of people who count on this digital technology nowadays it seems like that, that there needs to be a logo or some sort of image you know just to help guide somebody on what what's needed especially if we're talking about that maybe last minute, you know, doing something at the very last minute, don't you think something, uh, you know, that would be very helpful to somebody else? You know, that would be very helpful that uh, somebody would ask you to, 
please go ahead and include some graphics you know, to help us better understand uh, what the problem is. And uh, so that's why it seems like that um, that uh, each time you do think about that, and that you're 102, that, that the first thing that you were thinking about is that, you know, yeah, the originally, I originally developed this uh, picture right here for a portrait. But if you're trying to teach somebody something about something that they're talking about, you know, that might be harder for them to understand. So really, what's the best solution for that? And uh, most of the time, it's like, yeah, a simple yes or no you know, answers. And uh, so that's usually what it is. You know, I'll tell everybody, be quite honest with you, that uh, that's usually what it is. That's usually the case, by the way, that um, somebody asks a question and then uh, they're just one a simple yes or no about, okay, what do I do? Do I do this, do it this way? and uh, and uh, so that's why it seems like if you're going to be in a hurry, for sure, you go ahead and show, I'm like, yeah, yeah, you guide somebody just by starting a conversation with them and ask a question. So, yeah, like I did your discussions and, uh, yeah, in the comments. Uh, so, so whenever you do check your email, by the way, that uh, you might see something on your phone that talks about, uh, you know, how to join the conversation. And uh, usually it would be like a like a little invite, you know, something that looks like a a box or something, you know, right you know, right here on the left side or somewhere. But uh, still, that um, so each time you think about that, and you're one o two, that uh, you know you're used to listen only mode, and most of the time it's like you're used to just listening to what they had to talk about. But uh, it's like yeah, in case if anybody were to ask me, that what's the best response? If somebody were to ask you at least three questions, how would you respond to that? And uh, I would probably say that, uh, that you know, uh, would I would, you know, like, yeah, like maybe a few keywords, you know, tags and hashtags and keywords. You know, well, how would you respond to that? And uh, I would probably say is to where that, uh, that yeah, that uh, when we do talk about uh, understanding about, uh, you know, uh, simple responses and, uh, it's like, yeah, that uh, that whenever it comes to, uh, you know, uh, yeah, if, uh, you know, see, really, how, how would I respond to that? If we're talking about a few questions here, well, you know, how would I respond to that? You know, I do not know anything about this. You know, the first thing, yeah, the first thing I would uh, probably mention about is that, uh, you know, portrait, you know, right here, you know, picture, portrait, yeah, yeah, or, you know, how... Yeah, maybe a sticky note. I'm like, yeah. I would probably say that if anything, uh, the the graphic. Uh, yeah, I can just put on here. So if I were to say something like that, you know, uh, you know, the, like everybody might say, the graphics me, uh, graphics me can explain. And uh, so if you were to say something like that, you know, to on a conversation especially. You do think that all of your viewers would really understand that, and if anything, that maybe that that would be like maybe an abbreviation or something like that. Like if you're going to be starting a conversation, you're going to go by a username or something like that. But uh, everybody might say that, yeah, well, you know, uh, this right here looks like an actual person right here talking. But it's like uh, everybody might say that um, that uh, you know, is it really the same thing as compared to writing an actual letter? Like, when we're talking about messages. We're talking about letters and messages and other electronic documents. They are going to be, they are provided on a, you know, on a note, you know, on a discussion right here, right? But we're talking about maybe four or five pages within about 15 minutes or so that we're talking about information that's recorded on a form like this right here. So... That's why it seems like that uh, whenever you do think about that, that uh, that you know, at anybody who's going to be reading it, and anybody who's going to be you know responding to it, or even anybody who's going to be liking what what the responses are, and uh, that's why it seems that way to her. That um, you know, everybody might say that it's not the same type of skill that I learned from back in the earlier years. Back in the earlier years, you had the pencil and pen and Maybe I'm like, you know, other sorts of writing techniques that, uh, that we can remember, but uh, but it seems like that when we do talk about digital technology, it seems like that uh, 
do you have more ability for what you can do and do you have more paper for what you can do like whenever you run out of space right here that you can actually uh, you know yeah it starts off on the next page and all that and uh, so that's why it seems like that uh, you start these conversations a lot of times that uh, you know yeah not everybody can really read those messages and uh, that is why it seems like that um, you know somebody's going to be asking about that but you know half the time you're always want to know too that uh, that uh, whenever it comes to feedback and everything that uh, you know you're trying to concentrate on some of the messages that you're trying to uh, right and then let's just say that if you're working on some of those letters about your opinion without somebody bothering you all the time about writing to you and responding to your messages and so sometimes